this secret <laughs> rare robot Artemis. Oh no! Yes! None other entertainment's going down. Oh, I'm gonna have to destroy you. My God, the pulls are insane, man. Slow down, please. So if you guys are here for the pack battle, the remaining packs that I got to include these two retro packs that I have not opened will go towards a giveaway, a massive giveaway. And all you need to do to win all this coolness right here is to subscribe to my channel, like this video, and leave a comment basically saying if you're here to support me or Ruxin. I don't care if you say Ruxin, it's not gonna hurt my feelings because I totally get it, I understand. <laughs> but we're here to win. The winner will be announced via community post, so definitely stay tuned for that. What's up guys, and welcome back to another Epic Versus. Now this one is a truly, truly epic one with the man himself, the man, the myth, the legend, Ruxin34. Now, we ain't just doing one set, not even just two sets, but three sets. Oh yes, and it's gonna be pretty damn epic to see who wins in this Versus. Now granted, we can't do it live because of our scheduling conflicts, but he still accepts my challenge. And now it's time to react to his pulls right here, right now. Now it's actually full circle for me, but I'll talk about that more during my unboxing of this video. But first, let's go watch Ruxin and see what he pulled and what points he got at the end of this video. In today's video, we are opening some of the best sets from the last year, Rarity 1, Rarity 2, and Retro Pack 1. Indeed, indeed. We have 36 total packs to be open today between Rarity 1, Whew, that's Rarity packs. 2, that's a lot of packs. and Retro Pack 1. And why are we opening all of these, you might ask? Well, here's the story. None other entertainment hit me up like after Rarity 1 release. I know it's been a long time. <laughs> and you wanted to do a pack battle with Rarity 1. It didn't happen. Uh, it's it's okay, man. It's okay. Like, um, I, I know you're a busy man, and I'm also quite busy as well, but we, we made it work, man. We made it work, but... Here it is. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate it. Rarity 2 come out. He's like, how about we add Rarity 2? I'm like, yep, sounds great. But we didn't actually get around to doing it. And now Retro Pack 1's out. So it's been about a year. And I said, you know, let's throw in some Retro Pack because Retro Pack's super fun. Let's do a 36 pack battle. There is a scoring system here. So $1 to $4.99 cards are one point. $5 to $9.99 cards are two points. $10 to $19.99 cards are three points. And then $20 to $49.99 four points and then 50 plus is five anything under a dollar 99 cents or below it's gonna be zero points all right so with that let's in do mind, this let's get started with the opening okay double we got an ulti and a collector rare. no Beautiful. points there no That's points there nice. man so blank up carry number one not, Giant not, that's the decent. oh no and a secret <laughs> rare embodiment of a pop Whoa. is right off the bat okay that's got at least damn that's starting with the four plus. points we've got some points on the board ladies and gentlemen none other entertainment's going down okay <laughs> look he had to wait 11 months for this video so first of all sorry about that <laughs> no, second no. of all i'm gonna have to destroy you it's just hard to keep up with rarity there's so many cards dude out. yeah it's it really is it really is like uh, when it comes to like packs in general like like it's hard to keep up with some of the prices because they do fluctuate especially with the the reprints or there's multiple different rarities so obviously prices do fluctuate up and down some oh no thing. no was your dragon oh, ultimate no. slayer Roughly, oh. yeah, okay Platinum it's a point it's a point and rarity too come on or retro pack, man, this is just too hard. Ready to retro pack. <laughs> There's a lot of packs, man. This is too hard for me. We will defeat none other entertainment. He will not be entertained by this opening. <laughs> I like that. Anybody <laughs> two coming soon? Anybody I'm actually quite it? insane. Warlord Savage, Artemis. Oh, no! Yes! Oh, yeah! Man. That is our best pull so far. That's, that's probably over 20. That's probably a four-pointer right there. Dude. That might even be a five-pointer. Ah, uh, yeah, that's a good pull. Effect Valor QCR. That's a good pull. I kind of want to look that one up and see what that is. All right, live reaction. Near Mint First Edition, 5388. Oh, you son of a insane. biscuit. Pearly. Preparation right mm. another QCR. I feel like we're pulling so many of those. So many QCRs. Oh my God, the pulls are insane, man. Slow down, please. Please. Wow, we are off to a good start now. Wow, I cannot believe this. We are doing well in a pack battle. Maybe the key is I wait 11 months. <laughs> uh, probably not that, that, yeah. Well, I'm gonna try not to do that again. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Dang! Number six. Oh, the timeless. How are we pulling so many QCRs? This is crazy. And you give us a cyber. Harpy. Oh, if he pulls that, to put away none other oh, entertainment. If he pulls he that, will not be entertained by this opening. And a penguin soldier. I thought maybe for a second we had gotten mm. a big secret rare. But we scared him like that. 
Ruxin, don't be scaring me like that. Ooh, and right, Geki. Geki Ultra, is that our yeah. first Ultra of the day? The go card, Ash Blossom. Oh no! <laughs> he, he went through that pretty quickly. That was two points right there. Comes. Another QC oh. card. A Raikou! That's oh. gotta be money because, you know, Edison. It's gotta be worth some. Rarity 2. Can you bless us with another QCR? No, point, no I'm more. No more, please. Ghost, you'll have to see if he beat us or not, but I'm pr I'm feeling pretty confident. I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure we We'll see. Okay. We'll see. We haven't quite pulled pretty it yet. Sure we mind control. Oh, okay. Another QCR. I mean, it was only a point, but still. But still. How is this possible? It's like five or six QCRs. That's insane! You're wow, insane, my friend. Nuts, <sighs> guys. Final pack like magic. About our score. I mean, one of the best battle performances we've had in a long time. Lajin, the mystic. I used to be a dollar. I used lamp. to be a dollar. All right, I'll take it. It's a super rare at the end. Wow. Overall, a super fun opening. None other. Thanks for inviting me to the opening. Sorry, it took us almost a year to actually post it, but it happened. That's what mattered. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay. So. That is it right there. 31 points is our goal. Can we do it? I think we got a chance. Let's open some epic packs. All right, guys, so we have our points to beat. That is 31. Now, he pulled some epicness from Rary Collection 2, Rary Collection 1, and of course, packs he got from, of course, Retro pack. Can we do it? <laughs> I don't know. Most people watch this video is probably going to be rooting for Rux in the win, but uh, I'm still going to give him my best shot though. All right, let's go open this and pull out our 36 packs total. So 12 on each side. All right, here we go. All right, let's pull out our 12 packs. Now, granted, granted, I'm going to try to mix these up and uh, see what we can get from it. So I'm going to pull, I think, four to the front. Four to the back, and then uh, one, two, one, two. Right here, I want to do a mixture of left and right side. See, so one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, and one, two. All right, that should be 12. And then of course, our three booster boxes here for the grand total of 36 packs. All right, guys, whether you're here for Ruxin or for myself, press a like for luck. I guess without further ado, let's start. We're gonna start with the first one, which of course is Rarity Collection 1. Let's do this thing. So we gotta be 31, gotta be 31. Guys, know the point system, so we're just gonna go right into it. We got, of course, the Junk Speeder. Ooh, we got a, it's a prismatic. Oh no, it's quarter century. We got a, we got quarter century here of danger. The fossil dig. The artifact Lancia. So I think the this of course probably gonna be worth points, All right? Not too shabby. Three dollars and fifty five cents. So that is a point. Now just to make my life a little bit easier on the editing side, we're just gonna go and uh, just do all rarity collection one for now, and then all rarity two instead of switching it all up. But uh, yeah, like have to. That was a a year, uh, eleven months, as he said in the video, and, that, and that's pretty accurate. That's actually pretty accurate. But uh, granted, I know he was a busy man, so I I, I, didn't, I didn't mind too much. I didn't mind too much waiting because obviously, you know, he was of course gonna be the one to let me know if he's ready for my challenge. I'm just kidding. But of course, let's get into it. Uh, we got the Ooh Forbidden Droplet, <laughs> Pot of Prosperity as well. Okay, Evilly Match. Okay, some of the Evilly Match actually might be worth some points as well. So, but I think of course Forbidden Droplet is probably gonna be the one to to give us a maybe a two pointer. Oh yes, six dollars and twenty five cents. So that's definitely two points. Catching up, Ruxin. Catching up. What's kind of funny about these packs is I've, I've, been, I've been like kind of holding them off for almost a year, like as you were saying, but. Uh, I don't know. Ooh, Ash Blossom, but not the one we're looking for, though. Not the one we're looking for. <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, like, uh, just just kind of hold off with this pack battle. So we'll see what this quarter century, uh, oh, sorry, uh, the secret rare gives us. $8.17. Two points. All right. Moving on to the next rarity. Now we have the pull. Now, obviously, the look that uh, Ruxin had was insane. So, hopefully, we can match that with our own uh, luck. Danger. Ooh, it looks like a dud of a set. I don't think there's anything here. 
Yeah, 21 cents only on this one. So no points on that pull. It's okay though, it's okay. So far, I think it was the first pack that didn't actually give us points, so I'm actually okay with that so far. All right, go on reasoning. Ghost Bell, okay, secret. Egyptian. Servant. Another Ghost Bell, oof. I might have spoke too soon. I don't think I got anything for that. Maybe Ghost Bell, but I doubt it. I doubt it. I actually am quite surprised. The, the Platinum Secret Rare actually did pretty well at $2.77. So that's one point. That's all we need. Just one point. Just one point. All right, here we go. Come on, man. The pressure is definitely on. I, this, this is actually a very unique versus because I normally do like a, a live versus, but you know, face to face. But obviously, it was very hard to coordinate times with Ruxin. But uh, like, obviously, right, like it, it kind of shows like where he's at, and I'm trying to match that. And I don't think I got anything in this set. No, call for a grave is probably not nothing. Not nothing. Ah, I don't think anything is, anything is good. Okay, crap. Actually, damn. Okay, ultimate rare. I wasn't expecting this, but three dollars thirty-seven cents. That's a point. That's a point. I'll take it. I'll take all the points. All right, we're getting to the the, the final few from the uh, rare collection one. Oh damn. We're doing pretty well, actually. To be honest, like we're we're, we're in good pace. We're in good pace to beat the Roxana Thirty-four. All right, small world. Woo! Okay, we got our first, uh, actually it is our second one. So this is our second one. Uh, the quarter century of the red eyes flare. That was our first one, but yeah, we pulled one earlier. A little schism. Crystal, all right. Red flare, red eyes flare. You still got points for me. Oh yeah, $8.61. That is two points. Not just one, but two. Give me a two. All right. I'm not sure if Russell's gonna be watching this reaction video. Uh, I'm sure he, if he has time, he might, but uh, I'm catching up, man. I'm catching up. But uh, you, you made a comment about like, you know, like, you know, apologies and whatnot, but I, I totally, totally get it. Like you, you're a busy man. You don't need to uh, cater to the small fry, which is me. <laughs> Call the grave, Meg Knight. Oh no, <laughs> I don't think these things are good. I don't think this is good. Or I had my doubts before, but let's check out this secret. Secret E, that's a, that's a bad one, 24 cents. But I don't think any of those were actually worth anything. And by the way, if you're curious, like this mat right here, I actually got from Ruxin's uh, store. So if you guys want your own uh, mats, I, I'm sure you have, you have other stuff in, in the store, but this is where I got mine from his store. And uh, it's uh, definitely a beautiful, beautiful. It's kind of a little crooked though, I apologize. It was probably just my camera. Much better. <laughs> Some people might be, like, might be OCD about that. And uh, yeah, now it's uh, now it's center five, kind of. Yeah, this way. All right, here we go. Let's do this thing. Got the lone fire. Pre-preparation. Okay, the virtuous. Evenly match. Okay, and that's it. That's it. I think evenly match might still be worth points. Yes, oh <laughs> yeah. A dollar and 20 cents. A dollar and twenty cents, so we'll definitely take it. So yes, all right. I think we're at ten points right now. If I did my my map right. I have the change of heart. Chaos. The Ruxin spell, especially as he calls it. Ooh, we got the uh, the ulti of the evenly match, and ice bear. So we'll definitely go with the ulti here. Not quite two points, but yes, four dollars and fifty three cents. So yes. One point. We're actually at a very good pace right now. Very good pace. We might not even need retro pack. I'm just kidding. <laughs> we need all the points we can get. All right, here we go. Ooh, triple tactics. That might still be worth points. Ooh! -hoo! Oh! Oh, I matched it! I matched your your effect veiler with my effect veiler. Quarter century, baby! Oh, and infinite as well. This is a crazy set. Pot of prosperity. <laughs> but that effect veiler. Oh, Ruxin, I am so sorry. I'm so sorry. You're, like, I'm, I'm gonna get, like, my video is gonna have so much, like, dislikes. <laughs> oh man, please don't dislike my video. <laughs> yes, currently sitting at $54.92. So that, my friend, is five points. 
that that closes the lead or sorry cl closes the uh the gap there the only thing missing from that of course is ash blossom but wow what are the odds of also getting a fake valor oh my final pack here final pack of magic i, I doubt it i doubt it for this for this one and we still have got we still got very collection too we still got very collection too oh my god i'm sorry ruxin he's gonna he's gonna like block my video now like is that or, or block my channel I was like how dare he beat me no, i'm just kidding hopefully not <laughs> all right low spell effect veil of course there and of course we're going with the Nib nibiru nibiru secret is a three dollars and six cents so that is uh, one point wow from one from one set so far we got 17 points ruxin we match your effect with my effect veil <laughs> what are the odds of that? That's insane. That's insane. All right, guys, let's roll into a rare collection two now. Whew, what a crazy first pack right there. I don't think there's a pack challenge or pack. Well, there might be like a little pack trick, but we're just gonna go right into it. Okay, IP. Okay. Oh, oops. Sorry about that. The Crystal Wing Synchro Dragon. Okay. Um, pot of Duality. Ooh, Pot of Moon, but it's only a. Uh, looks like an an ulti. I know it is the the new prismatic. That's right. They changed it up on the set. The palmization and the forbidden lands. I don't think anything was really great here. So yeah, this prismatic secret rare of the Book of Moon is a dollar and sixty five cents. So that is one point. Next pack. Let's do this thing. Now in terms of points, like I feel like this one is like a little bit harder for me to find out which is the highest value because it's like oh, it's pretty random to be honest, pretty random because you never know what's going to be high value because I, I I don't think that prismatic is going to be the highest from that set. Anti spell. All right, Jester. All right, Ultra, and then another uh, prismatic. TG. Ooh, another one. I feel like a lot of these are like duds. What is going on right now? Yeah, this one, I think it's only, it's one of the best ones, I guess. But it's only 20 cents. Yeah. So no points there. I guess we can't have points all the time. But still. But still. Now, in terms of my favorite set from these three, it will definitely have to be the Retro Pack. Even though the, the value of those prices are not going to be super high comparably to the uh, Rarity Collection to some degree. Um, I still enjoy the retro because I'm, I'm more of a retro duelist, as you can see from my tunes right here. So tunes is definitely one of my my favorite uh, sets, even though they're very very hard to use in in a duel. All right, access cult. Okay, okay. There's only an ultra though, but it might still be worth points. Okay. Solemn strike, blue eye spirit drag, but only a secret. Oh, sorry, a super. I guess let's check out this assess code talker. Ooh, not quite. 83 cents only for this one. So rare collection two so far has not been, I guess, kind to me. So we'll see if I can get another one right here, right now. I mean, we did get that five pointer, so we can't really complain about the five pointers. But can we get another five pointer? Right, dual, exo sister. Okay, get a, a collector's rare of this one. Cosmic, Skill Drain, the Red Eye. Oh, I see something there, maybe. Oh, yes. <laughs> the Assess Code Talker 25th Anniversary Quarter Century QCR. I thought it was a quarter century for a second, but no, it is not. And no, yeah, it's only uh, the, the the Prismatic Secrets, but it might still be worth points. What do you guys What, what do you guys say? Do you say QCR? Do you say quarter century? Like, like I feel like... You should call it a quarter century, but a lot of people, I hear, I hear quarter centuries. Or sorry, I hear a lot of QCRs versus quarter centuries. The centering is terrible though. Holy crap, terrible centering. Not too shabby, $4.13. So I'll definitely take that as a point. Out of curiosity, how much was a quarter century? $25, okay. Yeah, but it's only one point. But it's fine, it's fine. So let me get a point per pack. We're getting close to that milestone of 31 points, Ruxin. And we still are... Okay, so still got like about halfway left with the rare collection one. All right, here we go. Got some judgment. Let's do this thing. Gold Scophagus. Ooh, okay, the ultra rare of the... We, we want the uh, quarter century of this one. All right, preparation of rights. Bingo, of course. 
and that was it. Whew. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I don't think any of these are going to be good. Okay. Got no choice here. I guess we'll go with the, the bingo. And bingo is an ammo. Secret rare. Not quite. 56 cents only for this one. So no points on that pack. Come on, we need points. We're almost at 20 points. If not already there, like, honestly lost track of my score. <laughs> I'll definitely double check on the on the edits here. Okay, the cosmic arrow promisation. The unchained souls. Twin. Enemy controller. Book of Moon secret. Ooh, okay. So you got a pris got the prismatic secret of the go the ghost moaner. And an IP secret. Or so sorry, super. Come on, just be a point, just be a point. Oh yes, definitely a point right there. $3.38. Whew, we are there my friends, 20 points. 11 more to go, 11 more points to go. Can we do this, can we do this? Oh my God. The pressure is definitely on. This is probably one of my most like pressured uh, like verses ever, like really, it really is. Because I, I kind of know what their score is, and I'm just trying to beat it. Versus like just the, the anticipation. Because normally I do a versus, it's you know face to face as I mentioned. But uh, yeah, any control there? Chaos Hunter secret. I don't think anything anything good here. No. Ah. If I had the pl the platinum secret, it, it would have been more points. But this is only fifty seven cents. Oh man. All right, here we go. Next pack. Let's do this thing. We still got like I think a few more packs of that and then we'll roll into retro. Drone lock bird, okay, okay. Okay, twin. It's a... Is it a... Platinum? No, that's the uh, ultimate rare. Got the skull. Secret. Abomination. Ooh, another abomination. That was a very abomination of a, of a pack, but... I don't know, let's see, Skullmeister maybe? Ooh, this is a bad one. Uh, only 20 cents, only 20 cents, so no points. Ah, come on, I need points, I need points. Oh man, uh, this is not looking good. We're, we're, we're getting to the, like the final few for the rare collections. And I don't know, I, I, I feel like Retro Pack has some good stuff in there, but sometimes they're, like, they're not super great in points. Not super great in points. All right, Mystical Space, Exo Sisters, number 60. Another number 60, Book of Eclipse, Mind Control. See, ooh, okay, we got another uh, quarter central here, DD Crow. That might be worth some points. Magical Souls. All right, Bomb B, at least a three-pointer? Is that asking for too much? Oh, yes. <laughs> $16.73, so that is indeed three points. Oh, yes, there it is. 23. Whew. Down eight points though. I don't know. This is, this is kind of getting to the to the wire here. Alright. Red Eyes. Mercy Teleport. DD Crow. Chaos. Forbidden Lance. Super Nimble. Charge. Trap Tricks. Oh no. Oh, surprise! This is actually very surprising. Secret rare. I I wasn't thinking this is gonna be points worthy, but this is a dollar and ten cents. Wow, so that has a point. Whew, we skated that one. I was not very confident with that pack. All right, down to the final two for rare collection two. Come on, give me one more quarter century. Give me one more. Let's go, Talker. TG. TG. Mind control. Psychic. Oh yes, this is quarter century. No, no, it's only, it's only prismatic, I think. Oh no, uh, yeah, prismatic. <sighs> Peaceful. Ah, I don't think this is actually worth any points, though. No. I mean, I was wrong before, but I'm pretty confident this one is probably not worth points. Yeah, sixty-three cents. So no points for that prismatic. Even it looks pretty, looks, especially on, on, on that white background, but no points. All right, final pack on this. I don't think, I think they only pulled like two quarter centuries from Rare Collection 2. M maybe three, but I'm pretty sure it's only two. Uh, hopefully I, I, I can put one right here, right now. A new controller. Come on, okay. Ultimate Rare. Oh no, that's a uh, Clicker's Rare. 
Solemn, ultimate. Okay, I think I saw something. Yes! Oh, another quarter century, but uh, is this still worth points though? Especially after the, after the ban? Oh, I guess we'll find out. And then the final card there. All right. I was hoping for a quarter century, but uh, we definitely got it, but not the one we're really looking for. Well, let's see if it's, how much we get here. Appaloosa, Appaloosa, quarter century. Quarter century, $12.68. That's enough for at least two points. All right. That's, that's pretty decent Go, going into uh, re, uh, Retro Pack. We're at 26 points right now. All right, guys, the final pack, Retro Pack. Finishing strong with the, the Retro-ness. All we need is what? Five points to tie? Six points to win. And this one is not opening very nicely. Not, not nice at all. Holy crap. It, it, it must be the nerves, guys. It must be the nerves. God, that was like the, the worst pack opening ever. This is like my job. <laughs> All right, uh, let's, uh, let's do a card trick to this one. At least that one has a for sure card trick. All right, palmization, elegant. We, we definitely want the cyber, cyber, cyber harpy arm. If we pull the cyber harpy, I'll be, <laughs> oh my God. Molten, giant rat, and only a magician of faith. I don't think that's a worthy points. Magician of faith, ooh, wow. I was not expecting that. Still points worthy, even for its rarity at a dollar and seven cent. A dollar and seven, that's a point. Ooh, we're getting close and we still have a lot more packs to go, Ruxin. I'm, 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 I'm trying to keep my expectations low though. Oh my God, and why can't I open these packs? Why can't I open these packs? All right. All right, one, two, three, four. All right, here we go. Can soldier. Gaia! This is a, like obviously like I'm an old school YouTuber or Yugi tuber as they call it here. You know? And uh, definitely like these so nostalgic. So we have to bring in the summon skull. So yes, that is a beautiful. It's only a, it's only a super though, but it's still a beautiful card. Might still be worth points though. But I, I definitely love this set. I would rather open up like the old school, old school, like Mission, Mission of Force or the uh, Metal Raiders and all that jazz, but uh, um, those are really expensive. Summon Skull, yes! Even as a super, a dollar and 27 cents. So that is a point. Oh, can we do this? Can we actually do this? Oh my God. The pressure is definitely on. I'm not gonna say we don't need the Cyber Harbor Lady, but if you have it, great. If you don't, ooh, that's a terrible saying on that very last card. Look at that, even the rear, you can see it. All right, flame, curse of dragon. Come on, giant germ, dune, mystic, upstart oh, goblin. Okay, I know. I, I think that's worth points. And the Kaiba man. All right, secret rare. I think I'll probably go with the Kaiba man to be honest. Kaiba man, Kaiba man. That is twenty points, Kaiba man. Ho ho yes, ho yes. Twenty points. Oh, 20 points. Twenty dollars. That's four points. Kaiba main! <laughs> oh my god. And with that, Kaiba man takes the win. Takes the win from Ruxin. Oh my god, I see the dislikes coming right now. I see the dislikes. Please, I'm sorry, Ruxin. I'm sorry. We're, we're obviously going to pull the rest of these just to see how much more we can get. Maybe we can pull some cooler cards as well. But wow, I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please don't hate me. Kaiba Man takes the win, which is kind of poetic because obviously Kaiba Man is like one of my favorite cards because it's just a stupid, crazy card. Oh my god. Baby Dragon! Curse! Trap Hole, Rising, Tune, Tune World, hell yeah. And the Harpies Lee Sisters. 77 cents only for this one, so no points. But, Kaiba Man, I guess we don't need to. But at the very least, guys, at the very least, enter this giveaway by subscribing. Because you, you might like some other stuff I do here. Obviously, 
like uh, I, I do a lot of the the same stuff that Ruxin does, uh, but a lot of it is uh, versuses with other packs. Could be old school, new school packs. Like, uh, like the next big one that I'm thinking about doing is of course the uh, the three way versus, which includes the uh, uh, Phantom Rage, Rage of the Abyss, and uh, uh, Phantom Nightmare. Yeah. So that's going to be a very epic versus down the road. And of course, similar to Ruxin, I also do uh, whatnot as well. So definitely follow me in my whatnot stream. Uh, my next one should be coming up sometime early November. So definitely stay tuned for that. We have cloning. This is the first time I ever got this one. It's also a secret rare. We actually, I actually pulled two secrets, which is actually kind of crazy. Cloning, $13.53. Wow. We, our luck isn't... I, like, I, I had like... I wasn't expecting a lot from Retro Pack, but it it turned it completely around. That's insane. 13, that's two points. Turned it completely around. I like I think my good luck charm right here is this mat. Like obviously, thank you Ruxin for, uh, for sending me this mat in beautiful condition. Obviously tunes are my favorite. And uh, yeah, like obviously ch definitely check out Ruxin's store if you haven't already done so. Um, but, uh, yeah. Alright, Psychic Bird! Change Germ! And the right leg of the Forbidden One. I think that still were points. Yep, $1.74, so that's an additional point. Wow. Should I just stop, guys? Like, I feel like Ruxin is gonna hate me. <laughs> I don't want him to hate him. Beat me. Like, not only did you beat me, but you just destroyed my score. All right, one, two, three, four. We got we got to pull the rest. It's only fair to uh, pull the the full thirty six. And definitely enter that giveaway, guys. Obviously, you, you'll be you'll be getting a, a lot of uh, good luck there. And it, ooh, Karibo, nice. You might meet, you put, you might pull something pretty great from there. Karibo, only ninety one cents, so no points. I remember that one being uh, like over two dollars at one point, but uh, that was definitely. Quite a, quite a while ago, quite a while ago. I mean, like Russell Rus was saying, we've been waiting for 11 months for this, this epic versus and like, honestly, I, I was not expecting such a, a, a turnout. It really wasn't. All right, come on, tune. Flying camera, okay. Gaia, the uh, secret rare, but now it's dropped down to a super apparently. Don't think that's worth any points. The dragon champion. Yep, 39 cents for this dragon champion. All right. Holy crap, guys. We still got four more packs left to go. We, maybe we'll have a chance at a Cyber Harpy Lady. We might have a chance. All right, here we go. Curse of Dragon. Magic Gem. Trap Hole. Mother Grizzly. Giant True Nane. Summon Skull again. Okay. Um, I think that was worth a point, right? Yeah, it was. It was a point. Yep. Additional point there. Come on, let's do this thing. Four, right? Yep, four. All right, Black Pendant. Giant Soldier. Got the Thunder. Thousand Dragon. A thousand? Yeah, yeah. I was thinking Thousand Bird. Uh, sorry, Bird confused me. Nimble. Giant Rat. And Sa Sangha of the Thunder. I think Sangha was still worth points. Yes, a dollar and twelve cents. So that is an additional point. Like Retro Pack is actually like surprising me right now. Like I was not expecting this many points from Retro Pack. I really wasn't. I was actually kind of nervous for getting into uh, Retro Pack, but the cloning as well as the Kaiba Man, that that just blew me away. We got Hane Hane or Hane Hane, Flame Swordsman, Molten UFO. Giant Trunade again and a Source Reveal Light. Okay. 72 cents. Oh, it dropped down in price. That used to be over a dollar. All right, final pack for me, guys. Can we pull something pretty epic on the final one? So definitely press a like for luck on getting this final epic pack magic. And yeah, it's four. Okay, I can count. All right, Cyber Late. That's a good start. It's a good start. All right. Man Eater Bug. Upstart Goblin was worth points, I believe. Mystic. And the embodiment, uh, embodiment, embodiment of 
Amber. So another secret. Wow, a third secret. And wow. Wow, the points. $17.70. Roxen, please. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, man. Wow. This, this is it, guys. This, this is like the first and only time I'm going to be collabing with the Ruxin now because he is going to hate me forever. Like, our next pack battle is probably going to be like 5, 10 years down the road. <laughs> but with that, that, that is going to be another, another three points. With my final score, at least I think I tallied it correctly, but 40 points with this one. Wow. Wow, Ruxin. But in, on a serious note, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope you guys stick around for some other epic openings. My luck is never this good. Like, <laughs> oh my god. But uh, insanity in the making. But uh, coming uh, stuff coming down the line, obviously, as I mentioned, I'm going to have a whatnot stream coming up very, very soon. In a couple of weeks from this video's release. Um, I will bo I'll also be opening up some Halloween stuff for, for, for Pokemon. So I, I do Pokemon and as well as Yu-Gi-Oh! For those who are new to the channel. Pretty epic as well. So definitely expect that uh, very, very soon. And of course, the big one, of course, is the giveaway. I normally don't do this big of a giveaway, but obviously with a with a match with Ruxin, you, you kind of have to. But this is like... A small plead, of course, to not hate me so much in the comments to the one and only, the legend himself, Ruxin. Um, a little backstory, obviously, like, uh, Ruxin was the one who really inspired me to get into pack openings. Uh, I watched his, uh, his, his uh, Legend of Blue Eyes opening back in the day. Um, I want to say it was like late 2020, um, but whatever whatever year that was, and it got me back into it. So I, I got to Chaos, and that's where I kind of started. And then I was like, why don't I just make videos about it as well? And that's what I did. So ever since then, I've been making videos on pack openings, as well as some other various things here as well. Um, so, but yeah, guys, into the giveaway. Enough of my rambling. You got, uh, if you guys want to stick around, definitely subscribe. Uh, and of course, into the giveaway. Also, by the way, guys, in my community post, I'm also doing like a poll as well, of, like the best set, um, almost like a tournament bracket thing. Uh, definitely place your votes on what you think was the best set because early January, I'm going to be doing an epic uh, versus as well of the best set. Uh, almost like a world series, if you will, for me and my channel. Um, uh, for those who are baseball enthusiasts uh, or WrestleMania or Super Bowl, of the, if you will, um, of the pack opening for at least my channel. And in January is when I do that. So whoever wins the final two goes into an epic versus in January. So place your votes on the best sets for both Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh! And we'll see who wins. And I do this every week. So every week there'll be a new... Uh, I guess poll if you will. If you guys want to see another epic birthday dip with another YouTuber, then check out this video right over here. It was pretty damn epic. And I don't win that one. I guess you have to find out. Again, my name is Talos. I'll see you next time. Peace.